What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to boost your FPS and increase your overall performance when playing Apex Legends on Windows 10. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions then leave a comment and let me know. If you are running the minimum system requirements, then these tweaks will help you out a lot. Everything you need will be listed in the description below. First, we will take a look at the in-game settings. Navigate to your video settings. Here, make sure to set the display mode to full screen and set the aspect ratio and display resolution to your native monitor resolution. In case none of these tweaks helped you out as much as you wanted, then you can lower these settings too. This will in any case improve your performance, but in return, the visual quality will suffer a lot. In the advanced section, disable vSync and anti aliasing and set your texture streaming budget to a lower amount than your actual VRAM availability. For low-end systems, this would be the very low setting. All of the other options, such as ambient occlusion, shadows and effects should be disabled or lowered to increase performance. These will not only depend on system performance, but also on personal preference. Some players with high-end systems still want to disable most of these settings to lower potential distractions in-game. I recommend to play a game to tweak your settings for the best performance quality trade-off. You can now close the game and open up your origin launcher. Here, navigate to your game library. Right-click Apex Legends and select Game Properties. Click on Advanced Launch Options, where you will be able to use some additional commands to improve your game's performance. Again, all of the commands I use, including some additional ones, will be listed in the description below. The no vid command will simply skip the video intro when you open up the game. FPS Max Zero This will uncap your FPS. If you want to manually cap it to specific value, such as 144, then use FPS Max 144. Force No VSync This command will disable all vertical sync. CL Show FPS 4 and CL Show POS 2. These two commands will show an in-game FPS counter and your map coordinates and speed. DX level 95 will use DirectX 9 to reduce the load on your GPU. And High will run the game in high priority compared to other programs. This is especially useful when you have other programs running in the background. Save your changes and open up your NVIDIA control panel. Open it by right-clicking your desktop and selecting it. You can do the same step with the AMD driver suit. Here, go to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add Apex Legends from the program list. Below, you will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. When this is done, search for Game Bar to open up your Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the Recording option, and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the Background Recording option. When enabled, these settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, open up your GeForce Experience application or AMD equivalent to update your graphics card. Depending on how frequent you are updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. Also, make sure that your operating system is up to date to get the most out of your system. If you still need more performance, then I suggest you to uninstall the game from your Steam library and re-download it to your solid state drive. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.